honourable members on the dais, faculty members and students, uh, I was asked to speak on the impact of uh, the weekend leader. Uh, you see, Vinoj Kumar, having worked as an investigative journalist, probably come to the conclusion that no matter how good an investigative story you publish, the impact is not much to write home about. Well, in my own experience of 50 years working for leading newspapers, uh, no matter how much we try to expose corruption, particularly in our political uh, setup, nothing has changed. So it is out of some sort of frustration that a few years ago, uh, Vinoj Kumar suggested, why not start an online edition on positive journalism? You know, in a country as vast as India, so many positive developments take place, but they don't find mention in the mainline media or the electronic media. So a humble beginning was made and then decided to honor uh, some of these individuals who have made something which makes a difference to the ordinary life of people. Now, I don't want to go back to all the people honored by weekend leader, uh, but two years back, Venkat Raman, who was supplying meals at one rupee a day. And you all know in today's cost that it is humanly not possible. And yet he wanted to make some contribution. And so his program was highlighted in the Weekend Leader and subsequently Times of India honored him as amazing Indian. Last year, I mean, some of you may have been uh, present here when Anil Joshi was similarly honored. His program was to construct check dam by collecting one rep rupee from the people who would benefit from such projects. I mean, it's an amazing thing that a check dam could, could be built and each one contributes only one rupee. And he has been able to do uh, a, a number of similar projects. And hundreds and hundreds of villagers benefited from such scheme. And today, <laughs> we have Bala Sahib, who has already revolutionized politics in the country. He started at the panjayat level, his idea is building from the bottom to going up. And he is a candidate for the coming Lok Sabha election. And he is going to demonstrate a Lok Sabha seat can be contested without spending crores of rupees which our political parties uh, spend to elect each candidate.